gas station we did we did stuff there we didn't stop at the uh hunting hunting lodge but i don't think there's nothing there we can stop here because it's on the way anyway so we can always take a look if there's nothing no still nothing it's like maybe there's uh, gonna something that we're gonna be able to use but it doesn't seem like so all right let's get out of here go back there so I still don't know how to uh... It waits a ton Maybe a crowbar? That wouldn't work Let's go fix stuff first Alright And we'll see Alright We still need fingerprints There was dead guys But I don't think they're fingerprints gonna be a uh... hmm because they are all skeleton like why doesn't it open this computer control the ash mechanism you want to open the silo hatch yes system failure I don't know uh, not that yet okay so we need to go in there right here so we can use the wielder pretty sure that's what the, that plug is for so let's see. So we have a set of circuit board. Everything seems to be fine. We have a filter, a lithium hydroxide filter is missing. We don't have that. Can we make one? That's the question. A filter. There was a toolbox. There's a socket for. Um, pretty sure we can plug the. Where is it? Golden kit here. Yeah, it's powered now. Just need some material to wield. And I do. Auxiliary air tank. We can uh, fix that real fast. We have those. There we go. Okay. Um, improve. We can do to improve the ship. I install a reserve or air tank. So air should be a okay we have pills we have uh, i think we have too much like we have the pills i fixed that thing and now we have uh, those uh a system is everything fine everything seems to be fine here i don't know the welding kit do i need because it says the hatch is uh as a pro oh i think it's a, a dangerous looking crack okay that's why, that's why, okay, 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 let's put it back there. Okay. I have a wielder, all right, but I need some something to put over this crack to fix it. Oh, well, a metal plate, how about that? 30 minutes, sure. <laughs> I mean, is it, I hope this will hold, it has to. Yeah, I hope so, I hope too. Everything else is good, all we need is the uh, filter filter a lithium hydroxide filter is missing lithium isn't lithium a battery thing can we fix it that wouldn't work about some wires not really about a gasket bad idea what about mix some of those no 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 about those <laughs> I'm trying. Oh, a voltmeter. Not really. Not really. I mean, I don't know. That? No. Uh, I patched all inside the ship. A filter slot. That's the only thing I have no clue. Maybe we can go back at the hunting lounge? Why is there a socket here? Probably for the welding kit, right? I plug in the, the welding kit, it's powered now, I just need some material to wield. Wield what? Was there a problem somewhere? Because I have a, like a... 
Use reel of wire? Bad idea? I mean, we have some wire and stuff, right? I don't see anything... I'm gonna let the, the wire there. Maybe the engine? With the proper tool, I could remove the transmission belt. No, that's fine. The fuel is fine too. Is there anything bad around? Go back up. No, 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 no. I don't want to talk with you. We don't have time for that. I don't want to talk. Because I fixed the, the hole, right? Everything, everything else should be good. Wait, what? A lunch pad. This lunch pad is empty. To put it simply, that chip has sailed. Or lifted to be more precise. Yeah. Okay. So how about we run a diagnostic, huh? Yeah. Yeah, the hatch is closed. That's a problem I don't know what to do with. All integrity check complete. Air compass is selected. Fuel mixer selected. Fuel catalyst present. Air supply lowered because they use the air saving fuel. This, the access system is damaged. Please perform a manual onboard inspection to complete the diagnostic. Everything is fine. We have fuel, we have mixture, we have air, we have integrity. The silo hatch is uh, bad though. Not sure how to fix that one. Let's try again. Yes. No, system failure. A system controlling the silo hatch. Uh, can we fix it? I cannot do that. I don't think so. The glue? That wouldn't work. What? 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 Not really. I, um, I don't know about the hatch. Hmm. Yeah, that's uh, the, the part that is okay. Let's go back up. Oh, yeah, I read that. Okay. This is a problem. Can we do something? Can I shoot it? No. Uh, can I use it? Uh, not really. I should do be able to do something, right? I don't know. Maybe stop the electricity. I don't know, I'm gonna check around guys. Uh, I have no clue what to do now. So I put back the transmission belt here. Maybe maybe that's what it's used to open the hatch. Once the hatch is open, I can bring it back here. But for now, uh, I think that's the problem, right? Yeah. All right, but we need it to go uh, back up there. I still have no idea about that uh, that door. So now that the hatch is open, yeah. We just need I can bring take that back. We still have 6 hours. So we're pretty good. The only thing I need is the filter. I don't know. I'm going to save and I'm going to look around. So I went all around every site in the map. And I still have no idea how to open that door or to get the uh, the filter. So I'm going to try to launch the, the thing and see, uh, see what's up because I'm out of ideas. That's the only two things. And there's a, a dark place in the lab that I have no idea because when I use the lighter it says that the wind is blowing. And uh, when I try to uh, put something on the door it says it no. So I don't know how to get there. Yeah. Can I, can I just like... No. Okay. Well, we're gonna give it a go. Because everything is um, pretty much good. Okay, so doesn't uh, anything else. The hatch is already open. Diagnostic. Everything is alright. Except the, uh, the filter. So maybe we don't need it. We'll see. Well, let's go. Oh, I have to reinstall the... Oh, let me grab uh, my wielder. 
Just in case you know that we need it and space, right? I need to reinstall that. That would what, what do you mean that wouldn't work? That that sure works. Yes. Because we can use stuff on what? Oh, on the console? I think we're fine. The console says it's okay, we have fuel and everything. So yeah, are we ready to launch? I've made some calculation and we barely have enough fuel to get to our destination. We have to limit our weight. And you seem to be carrying a lot of stuff with you. I like picking things up. You never know when you're gonna need a water sprayer, you know? Well now you have to say goodbye to your belonging. Take on things that weight, say one kilogram in total. One kilogram, fine. God damn it, now I have to drop all my stuff. Uh, okay. Well, we don't need... Oh, duct tape is, is the best thing ever. You cannot drop item here. Well, do, do I need to go back down there? Where, where do I need to drop my stuff? Let me drop my stuff over here, alright? So we don't need tools anymore, yeah. But I only, I only have right to one kilogram moment. <gasps> look, look at all the stuff I have. Even a gun, alright? You, you're making me drop my gun. Oh no, I wanted the lighter. Well, if I don't have the gun, I don't need the bullets, huh? Uh, we don't need those, we don't need those. I'm not a hoarder, okay? Stop. Stop. Don't judge me. Oh my god. The wielder? Okay, so we're under one now. We, we don't need anything, we're going to space, like... I want a lighter and a, a duct tape, that, that's, all I, that's all I want. There you go. Are you happy woman now? Huh? Yeah, do you want to say something before we leave? No, let's get out of here. I cannot believe she said that. I, sh I should have maybe brought uh, food and water. Maybe. We'll see. I can go back and grab some stuff. Let's launch! Ready when you are, David. Oh god. Take a full of pill for lung efficiency, yeah. That's it. The wall was ending. The moon cracked into pieces was moving rapidly towards the planet. Both celestial bodies pulling each other apart. All systems green. Well, some systems were green. You didn't have time to check every last nut or seal like people did before rocket launch in the old days. It looked at you with their heads on. Engine is ready. Initiating launch procedure. Overriding safety protocol. Manual control engaged. How does she know how to pilot a spaceship? The hatch was open, leaving you a clear way toward the sky. That's a good thing. Five, four, oh no, that's gonna be bad. Three, two, buckle up, it's going to be one hell of a ride. One, zero. Okay, we launch. That acceleration first push you hard into your seat, squeezing all the air from your lungs. A rocket begins its ascent. You look back at Sikari in his seat. The kiss has been through a lot, yet he was lucky enough to end up with you on this ride. Yep. The seat next to him was empty, at least you've kept the kid safe like the big old man wanted. Oh, we d we're doing it! The spaceship came to the sky fast and without much trouble! Ooh! Sergeant and his men were standing on top of a hill. He traveled far west since you had at least seen him. The whole squad raised their head and gazed into the sky, tracing the bright light of your rocket. Would you look at that, smirk Sarge, slowly shaking his head. That kid actually did it! Good luck with whatever you find there, he added before he turned away. The whole squad decided to open their last bottle of whiskey and drink it as the world around them started falling apart. While the vessel was smoothly gaining altitude, you grew worried about life support. Because the default setting had been corrupted, you were forced to create the air composition yourself. Did we do a good job? The composition was perfect. The air reserve system for you, you for a long time. The ship, the ship, the ship didn't have any kind of filter to get rid of carbon dioxide. Yeah, as a result, the air quickly became heavy and stuffy. You installed rare, a reserve air tank in the shuttle. When the regular air ran low, the reserve kicked in, providing you with more life-saving oxygen. Good thing you noticed and fixed the crap in the chip hole. Your repairs save a lot of air from leaking out. You prepare some pill to temporarily enhance lung efficiency. You took one and it reduced the amount of air you use during the flight. Okay, took a pill, same thing, and Cody. That's it. 
we're not gonna make it at this rate, we'll run out of air before we land. You remember that there are space suit in the back, it's time to use them! That won't be enough, said Kate, they are for emergency use and only have air for a couple of minutes. It is an emergency, you are! We have to move faster if we want to make it, decided Kate. I'll use some of the reserve fuel to speed up, but we won't have enough of it left to slow down before landing, so hang out to something! Oh no. You made it to orbit and from there it was surprisingly a short way to the moon. However, Kate had to fly the ship much faster than expected. We were coming in too fast. We crashed, didn't we? Did we crash? Don't crash, Kate! Come on! That, that's not how you uh, you land a ship, but sure, do it. Oh crap! Did you survive? That was a rough landing, but she's good with rough landing, though. Hello. Was that all for nothing? Well, Cody's alive. Uh, Kate is dead. Kate. Okay. Oh god. Oh no. That landing. Don't move, Kate. I messed it up, David. You did all you could. We didn't have enough fuel to land safely. Maybe if we had prepared better. I couldn't find that. It's Cody, okay? Yeah, I think it's fine. Don't worry. So, looks like this is the end of the road for me. No way, Kate. I'll carry you if I have to. Ha! <laughs> Cough. Don't make me laugh. I'm done for. Listen very carefully. Lean in, please. It's hard to speak. You've got to use a space suit to get to the station. When you're there, look for Sleeper's Pod. That's your way out. Dream. And... Kate? Kate? No, Kate! I'm sorry, Kate. Don't worry, I'll reload and do uh, and do better. Alright, we, we need to uh, storage compartment. Quick, 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 Cody. I should check up with everyone before... Oh, crap. Cody, are you alright? Uh, I don't know. Can you stand? I think. What's that sound? Are we going to die? No, of course not. Where's Kate? Uh, <coughs> she's sleeping. No, sniff. No, she's sleeping. That's fine. Okay, grab a space suit. Let's get out of here. Come on. Cody, come here. Initiating the compression procedure. Sorry, Kate. Okay. Okay, let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> but, but the moon is crashing on her. What's, what's gonna help us? Let's go. Do it. Airlock. Airlock of a ride mechanism. Come on, let's get in there. Let's get in there before everything is over. Oh god. Oh god. Does it have to uh, be able to go reach the middle or something? Not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Okay. Maybe they need to reach uh, both? There's no explanation. Airlock? I have to find a way to open... Okay, okay. Well, let's let's figure this out. I think it's going somewhere. I'm not sure what I did, but uh, I think I had to connect all the rings. I think it's a safe to remove that thing. Uh, I wouldn't try, but... Uh, hello? Anyone here? Wait, what's this? Something is in my pocket. No, did Kate slip it in the ring or last thought? Oh god. I write this in case something happened to me, David. You have to carry on. It's really important that you do what I say here. First of all, sorry for not telling you everything earlier. You must understand this whole thing is difficult to believe in. And I didn't want to overwhelm, overwhelm me with all this stuff. Secondly, don't panic. But there is no magical portal to the safe place. All you'll find in the moon base are sleeper pods. I have never been there, but they keep them all in a large room. It's probably hard to miss, even for a muff like you. The pods contain sleeping bodies, and yes, they will all be destroyed when the moon falls. That won't matter, too, though, because the consciousness of each of those people has been transferred to a different place, a different universe, a different version of this world. Probably a safe one, where Sidereal, Sidereal didn't blow up the moon. I know this is hard to swallow, I wish I could explain everything in more detail, but since I'm probably dead at this point, it won't be possible. 
Find a sleeper pod and send your consciousness elsewhere. This is the only way out, and I really hope all their systems are operational, because if they're not, you may end up in a world that is only an inch away from ours. I think that's already happened in a parallel universe. That's why we're, we were having all those dreams. We have memories from other versions of us. I'm not sure how it works, but I guess that's what happened when their system cannot match you with an unoccupied body. Just my theory though, anyway, I'm writing this as you fix the ship, hoping that that uh, you will never have to read this, however, if you do. I just want you to know, I appreciate everything you did for me. I hope you make it. If you happen to find me in another universe, come say hi. Just kidding. It would probably freak me out. Don't stalk me, okay? <laughs> Take care, David K. Oof. Uh, a passage or a passage? I don't know if you can... Oh, what are those? Some sort of hibernation pod. Those people are sleeping. It's in something about sleeper's pod. Is this really the way out? Some sort of mind transference? Uh, black card? Sure. Diagnostic screen? System memory? Alright. That's not a lot. Floppy disk A? <laughs> no disk. Floppy drive, drive B? No disk. It's control lock. Okay, how about uh, I use that? No. Okay, so I have... Uh, what is that? Pod is empty but closed. Can upload consciousness into the realm of dreams? Okay, how about we go to the other side then? I mean. Oh, oh. Oh, everything is going to crap. Oh no. A card reader, quick! Quick! Oh no. Oh. Access granted. Computer control! The console lets you gain access to sleeper pod. Once you have it, you will be able to open and use any- Yes, yes! Do it! Access granted! Okay. Let's go, Cody! Run! <laughs> Run! <laughs> oh my god! Are we gonna make it? We need to make it, Cody! Come on! There's uh, four. So you can save everyone. Wait! Sleeper pod active, occupied pod 52 out of 64. Face controller cut interrupted, unable to select destination. And, and emergency mode. Emergency merge mode enabled. Sideral plexus technology responsibility for memory loss. And or personality merge. Oh crap. Let's go, Cody. Let's go. Get in there, Cody. Time to sleep, Cody. It's time. I don't want to sleep. I know, but we all have to. I won't be able to sleep now, I'm too scared. This machine will help you. Come on, don't be scared. What will happen? Where will we go? I don't know, but it's going to be alright. David, I don't want to be alone again. You won't be. Wherever you wake up, I will find you. Promise? Promise. Oh god. Let's go. Yeah. What the? No, 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 no. I sure you want to hit the initiates. Yes, yes. Yeah, no! No. No. Well, it's too late. It's too late, Cody. Sleep well, little prince. I'm sure you want to hit the initiate and this in plea bottom and get you to the sleeping point. <sighs> Main power is offline. Well, this is the end. Yeah. I don't think we can go anywhere. Oh crap. Run! You take a look at the screen and realize that while sleeper pod have their independent power reserves, you won't be able to initiate another pod unless the main power is back. There are some unnecessary check unnecessary system powers such as communication array. This is a standard procedure so the crew is able to call for help. But there's no one that can help now. You could try to reroute that power to the Yes, do it! Okay, okay, run! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god, run! Do it! Do it! No, 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 run, 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 run! Oh my god! Just do it! Go to sleep! Go to sleep! Yes! I hope it works fast, cause, uh... We're gone. We're gonna wake up right there, aren't we?
Well, there's four PUDs, so I'm pretty sure you can save everyone. How? Uh, maybe if I if I found the um, the filter at the end. Um, but for uh, our other friend, I don't know. Maybe we save the guy and Cody live by I don't know. We can try uh, different stuff. There's probably different. Uh, yeah, I knew it. I knew it. What a nightmare! It all felt so real. I feel like something is missing. Like I didn't do something important. But what? A gloomy memory that disappeared too fast. I don't remember. Well, I guess it was just a dream. And that's the end. Yeah. Well, there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoy. And if you want me to do a second playthrough and try to maybe save everyone or try different stuff, I know there's a, a lot more um, like different days. There's a bunch of stuff we didn't see. I think it's random. So every time someone plays, there's like different scenario every day. So we might not even get the same one and we have to do other stuff. Like we didn't use the water and other things that we might be able to use in other scenario. So anyway, I, I, I really like the game. It's a really cool game. It's simple, uh, but it's good. The story is good. Uh, I love the, the pixel art. So I really did enjoy. I really did enjoy the game. So like I said, let me know if you want to see more by leaving a like and a comment down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.